so happy that you're all here. Welcome to the show. Hey guys, you did it, you did it, we made it. It's the, it's the first day of spring. Spring has sprung, we are here, we're doing it. So, uh, yeah, so congratulations to the people of Nebraska who survived winter. <laughs> now all you've got to do is get through severe thunderstorm and tornado season and you'll be fine. <laughs> uh, now, one place things aren't getting warmer is at the White House, where on Friday, Donald Trump met with the German Chancellor Angela Merkel and appeared to ignore requests for a handshake with her. I'll let you enjoy the awkwardness. <laughs> <laughs> they don't look like two world leaders. They look like two people at a divorce hearing. <laughs> You're never getting custody, Angela. Um, now, some critics are calling this sexist. Other people are saying it's because Trump is a germaphobe. Other people are saying he's just rude. And, uh, and I'm one of the people who's like, guys, guys, it's, it's all of the above. <laughs> Uh, also in the news, Donald Trump Jr. has been the focus of a lot of attention after the New York Times published a profile with him uh, posing uncomfortably on top of a tree stump. Here he is here. Look at this. Wow. wow. So natural. <laughs> it's, it's like the photographer said, well, don't sit down, but don't stand up either. <laughs> Just, oh, and then it to, to... I mean, you can tell he hasn't spent a lot of time in nature. He kept asking when the gardener was coming to clean all this up. <laughs> I mean, look at him. He looks like a constipated version of the brawny paper towel guy. <laughs> Doesn't he? <laughs> Meanwhile, uh, plans for the border wall continue on Sunday. Fox News reported several requirements that the White House has issued for the wall. Now, this is real. They said it must be 30 feet high, good looking from the US side, <laughs> and difficult to break through. Basically, the wall should be tall, but not fat or ugly. <laughs> it's pretty much like Trump just updated the Miss Universe regulations and then just made them about the wall. <laughs> Isn't it? <laughs> but that is real, seriously. The White House's memo did say the wall must look tasteful from the American side. And if you need something to look tasteful, you know you can always count on this guy. <laughs> <laughs> now, we wanted to show you this. There was a, a, did you see this video? A video of a very large chicken went viral over the weekend. How very large, I hear you ask? <laughs> large. Take a look. heart in a suit. <laughs> Isn't it? I can't... Like... <laughs> I can't believe I'm saying this on CBS, but I've never seen a cock that big. <laughs> I mean, look, that chicken... That thing looks like it should be standing next to Snuffleupagus telling you what the letter of the day is. <laughs> And um, finally, we wanted to show you a video of this super fan who got really into the March Madness spirit this weekend. This passionate young fan got very upset when the other team started to pull away. Take a look. <laughs> I mean, that's basically me when my personal trainer tells me to do three more sit-ups. <laughs> And when I say more, I mean three sit-ups. <laughs> but here's the thing, I don't think he was overreacting. It turns out that he got freaked out, not by the game, by something on the Jumbotron. And I think we have this from another angle. <laughs> 